Mental College. In chapter 2.5, we will be learning about common and natural logarithms. Okay, so at this point in time, let me just uh, explain what, what a common logarithm. So, common base of 10. Okay, and we also write it as LG. Okay, so for example, log base 10Y is equivalent to LGY. Okay, so let me show you how to solve this or rather break this down. So, suppose I have log base 10y equals to 2, okay, then y is simply 10 to the power of 2, okay. Learn earlier in the chapter of logarithm, log a y equals to x, if and only if y is equals to a to the power of x, okay. So, in this case, my a is 10 and my x is 2, okay, so y is to 10 to the power of 2, okay, or 10 squared. Okay, so one more example. So as we mentioned earlier, log base 10 is the same as LGY. So suppose I write LGY or we can read this as log Y. So log Y equals to 5, for example. Okay, so to get rid of the log, just take base 10. So Y is just 10 to the power of 5. Okay, so that's all for common logarithm. How about natural logarithm? Natural logarithm is log to the base of E. Okay, so for example, and this is also, this can also be written as ln. Okay, so ln is written as ln. So log base ey is equals to ln y. Okay. Okay, so at this point in time, let me show you how to, how to solve a, a very simple equation. So let's say I have ln y equals to 2. Okay, to solve for y, we will take exponential, okay, or e on both sides of the equation. So it look like this, e ln y equals to e power 2. Okay, take note that e and ln will cancel each other out. Okay, and so y is just e squared. Okay, so typically in your in your working, you can skip the second step, the step over here. Okay, and go straight to the last step. Okay, so one more example. So suppose ln y is equals to 5, then y is just exponential or e to the power of 5. Okay, we'll look at some tougher examples later. Okay, so the lesson objectives for 2.5, chapter 2.5, we will learn how to understand common and natural logarithm, which, which we just did. We will learn how to apply laws of logarithm to solve equations. And finally, we will evaluate logarithm to any base. Okay, so just now I was introducing you guys to log y equals to x, if and only if. This sign with a double implication means if and only if. So if and only if, okay, y is equals to 10 to the power of x. Okay, and for natural logarithm, ln y equals to x if and only if y is equals to e to the power of x. Okay, let's look at more tangible ways to solve uh, for this. So let's, uh, before we do example 1a, let's just recap. To get rid of ln, okay, or rather ln, ln is read as natural logarithm. Okay, natural log. And log or equivalent LG okay it's read as common log okay to get rid of natural logarithm take exponential and to take to get rid of common logarithm take base 10 okay to use base 10 okay so what do I mean so over here in example 1a we have ln x equals to log 2 so we want to solve for x so to solve for x and since we have a natural logarithm we will take exponential on both sides of the equation Okay, so exponential ln x equals to exponential log 2. Exponential and ln will cancel each other out. So x equals to exponential log 2. Okay, press this in your calculator. Round it off, you will get 1.35. And this is to three significant figures. Okay, take note that this button, okay, LG, LG, or looks like this in the calculator. Okay, LOG. Okay. Okay, so at this point in time, let's move on to example 1b. Okay, in example 1b, um, the first thing I'm going to do is to divide both sides by log 2. So I have ln 4x equals to 3 over log 2. Okay, divide this over. The next thing I'm going to do to get rid of ln, remember, we will take exponential on both sides of the equation. So exponential ln 4x equals to exponential 3 over log 2. Okay, and exponential alone will just cancel each other out. So we have 4x equals to exponential to the power of 3 over log 2. Okay, 
And finally, x is just 1 quarter times exponential 3 over log 2. Okay, at this point in time, maybe let me just show you how the log button looks like in the calculator. Okay, so the log button is over here, as you can see. And uh, let me just point out also that the exponential button is over here. Okay, you have to press second function and press the ln button in order to get your exponential key. Okay, last example. So ln x whole thing square is equal to 3. So ln x is equal to plus minus square root of 3. Okay, so there are two, two cases for us to consider. ln x equals to root 3 or ln x equals to negative root 3. Okay, so for the first case, I take exponential both sides. So x is just e power root 3. And for the second case, x is e power negative root 3. So finally, if I press this in my calculator, I'll get x equals to 5.65 or x equals to 0 0.177. Okay, to 3 sig fig. Okay, so just to summarize, common logarithm refers to log to the base of 10 and natural logarithm refers to log to the base of e. Okay, in the first case, we often use lg as an as a easier way to denote it and for the second case, we often use ln or read as ln. Okay, let me some practice questions. You can pause the video and take them down. Okay, thank you for watching this video. For more videos, log to pencilcollege.com. I'll see you for now.